After 10 games with two different teams, Adrian Peterson's 2017 season appears to be over, according to ESPN.com. The Cardinals have decided to place Peterson on injured reserve. The ringback who HASNT played since Week 12, missed the Cardinals' past two games with a neck injury that DIDNT seemed to be healing. Peterson suffered the injury during Arizona's November 26 loss to the Jaguars and HASNT practiced since. Before the Cards played the Titans on Sunday, Arizona coach Bruce Arians was asked if he thought Peterson might return this season, I have no clue. It's something that he and doctors are working through, Arians said last week, via ESPN.com. He's walking around fine. It's just a matter of being able to take a hit and getting all of his strength back. Before the Titans game, Peterson shared a video on Instagram that showed the exact play where he suffered his injury. In the post, he sounded optimistic that he might return this season, writing that he just needed some TLC and rest to heal. As things stand, he's now going have an entire offseason to rest. Peterson will finish his odd season with 156 carries for 529 yards and two touchdowns. Of course, not all of those yards came with the Cardinals. The 32-year-old running back started the season in New Orleans, but was traded to Arizona following Week 4 after the Saints' DIDNT feel he was a good fit. In six games with the Cardinals, Peterson rushed for 448 yards, with his biggest game coming in Week 9 when he carried the ball 37 times for 159 yards. The only reason the Cardinals traded for Peterson is because starting running back David Johnson was lost for the season with a wrist injury in Week 1. With Johnson set to return next season, it wouldn't be a surprise to see the Cardinals let Peterson go. Although the aging running back still has one year left on his deal, the Cardinals would only take a small cap hit for releasing him. If Peterson does get released, he might not have a huge market. The 32-year-old was a free agent for more than a month before the Saints signed him in April.